All right, this is a continuation of specifiers. So with the specifiers, you should already know that it's going to be the nga with the a or ha in it, right? Or in this case, nga with the a or ha na. But we're going to look at two two more types of uh, specifiers. Well, no, I'm not, we're going to look at two more um, two more cases of specifiers. Not types, but cases. So the first one is glottal stops. Um, words that end in a glottal stop. Nouns that end in a glottal stop will have the a uh, ending to it. And nouns that end in triphthongs, right, triphthongs, they will have the hana ending to it. So glottal stops with the a uh, and triphthongs with the hana. Um, and these are the examples I have, right? So da wo is a triphthong, right? A u o, right? You hear that a u and o, da wo, da wo, da wo. And therefore, we get the hana ending to it. So we have the first three letters, which is dao and hana, right? Dao hana, kanang dao hana, right? Kana nga dao hana. So that kind of person, or that person, unsa nga dao hana. What person, right? Or which person are you talking about in that case? Which person? It's a specifier. You're specifying what. Kind, what what particular noun right and then babaye right babaye is also a trift song right a e e babaye right a e e so we get bai hana bai hana and again it's like tau hana bai hana um and the last two examples i have are what are words that are nouns that end in a glottal stop um bata right bata Bata is uh, ends with a glottal stop after the a, and since it ends in a glottal stop, it has to take the, another a ah in it. So we get bata a, right? What's up, bata a? Like what? What's up? You know, what's up, bata a? What kind of what child was that? Like, um, kanang nga bata a that child, right? Kanang bata a, you know. Uh, suka, right? Suka, suka a, right? It's another one, suka a. But this is just another continuation of the specifiers video.